Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show how I created a tray table for my Valencia Tuscany home theater seats. My Valencia Tuscany seats did not include a tray table at the time I purchased them. I do believe as of the making of this video that tray tables are included in the purchase of their chairs now. So I kind of missed out on that. Instead of simply ordering a tray table for my Valencia seats, I decided to try making my own. I like a good project, so this seemed like a fun challenge and a chance to save a little bit of money and direct those funds to my home theater fund for other things. The tray table itself is about 16 by 13. I made it out of some scrap one by eight boards that I had on hand. I cut them 13 inches in length and glued those together. I didn't capture that part of the project on video because I did it several months ago before I thought of posting this, but bonding the two pieces of wood together with glue was pretty straightforward. Here I'm using my router to round off the edges. I think it gives a nicer look and the rounded edge is more comfortable than a sharper pointed 90 degree edge. The wood I use is premium pine, so it's already pretty smooth to the touch, but after using the router, I did a quick sanding with some fine grit sandpaper. <laughs> I'm applying a primer here because I was initially going to paint it black and add a protective finish, but I only got as far as the prime paint. I changed my mind, decided to go with a vinyl wrap. I felt it would be a cleaner look and more durable. It would also have a nicer feel. I could have sanded off the primer, but I left it on. The wrap goes on super easy. Here I'm going to use my expired Krispy Kreme gift card to smooth out the wrap and press out the bubbles. The only challenge was the corners. They could look a little better, but they don't look that bad. I think it looks pretty good. There are a few tiny raised spots. I should have wiped it down a little better than I did before putting on the wrap, but it is fine. Here I'm placing more of the wrap on the bottom. I'm not worried about seeing the seams here because they're on the bottom. This block is more scrap wood that I had on hand. I drilled a hole through it for the pin. The pin will attach the tray table to the seat and I'm gonna wrap this too, as you can see me doing here. I fed the pin through the block. It's a pretty tight fit, but I added some super glue anyway. A little bit of that glue got onto the pin, so I'm sending it off here. The pin itself is a metal clevis pin. Here I'm measuring out the placement of the block and the pin on the tray. And I'm gonna use wood glue to adhere the block and pin to the tray. I want it to bond wood to wood, so I cut out some of the wrap. The wood glue should be enough. Thank you. 
Here I've clamped it all down to make sure I've got a strong, secure bond. And here is my son walking through the shot, trying to be helpful. I left it clamped down overnight and here is the finished tray table. This is not as finely finished as a new Valencia table tray, but I essentially made it out of scraps. The only components that I had to purchase was the clevis pen, which was $3 at my local home improvement store and the vinyl wrap, which was $14 on Amazon. I love the vinyl wrap. That was a really good idea. It's a little big, but I like the size. It's not completely level. There is a slight lean to it. Not enough that I'm concerned that items are gonna slide off. But if I try making this again, I need to be more mindful that the pen is completely straight. I'll also slow down and make sure that the surface is absolutely clean and free of any tiny particles because there are just a few tiny raised spots. It's not a big deal. It's not even really noticeable, but I noticed it just because I examined every tiny millimeter of this tray as I was building it. But lessons learned, some trial and error. I'm gonna call this a successful first pass. So I'll give it a few more weeks, put in some use, see how durable it is, see how it stands up to regular usage over time, and I will do a follow-up after a few weeks. But this is the final tray. Let me know what you think in the comment section below, and thank you.